Hi everybody, welcome to Outpost. I'm so glad you're here. My name is Julia and today we'll be doing a project called Grow Your Own Rainbow. I love this project because it's a little bit of art, a little bit of science, and a lot of color and I love the rainbow and I love colors. So why don't we see what supplies we need to get started. For this project, you're going to need washable markers, preferably the color of the rainbow, a paper towel, two almost full cups of water. I have a sheet of paper for underneath of my paper towel in case the markers bleed through while I'm coloring, and then a pair of scissors in case you need to cut your paper towel a little smaller. And that's it. Let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to do is cut my paper towel just a little bit smaller because if your paper towel is too long, the rainbow may not make it all the way across. I'm just going to cut a little bit of this off and my paper towel is now about 5 by 7 and a half inches. I'm going to use this piece right here. The next thing I'm going to do is start coloring both sides of my paper towel. I'm going to do it over top of my paper. Here we go. And our paper towel is now ready. Alright, let's grow our rainbow. So you want to put just a little bit of each end into the glasses of water. One on that end and then you might need to move your cups a little closer. One on this end. They're both just barely in the water. Your fingers might get a little bit messy and now it's time to watch our rainbows grow. What you're seeing right now is called capillary action, which is when a liquid is able to spontaneously flow through a narrow tube or porous material. This movement does not require the force of gravity to occur. In fact, as you can see here, it often acts in opposition to gravity. Isn't science cool? And once your rainbow has made it all the way across, you can take it out of the water and put it down somewhere to dry. We did it, we grew our own rainbow. It was really cool watching the water travel up the paper towel to meet in the middle and make a rainbow. And now I decided to turn my paper towel into some cute little hearts and also write a note. So once your paper towel dries, turn it into some cool art to hang around your room or write a note for someone. And thanks for watching. Thanks for joining us. To learn more about the Painted Turtle, a camp for children with serious medical conditions, visit our website, www.thepaintedturtle.org. See you next time.